Hello, welcome to another TechWizKid24 video tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to make a custom Left 4 Dead auto exec um, for things like keybinds and whatever that you wanted the game to load up every time you start Left 4 Dead. So, first step is go to your start menu, computer, local disk, program files, uh, times 86 if you're on 64 bit, Steam, Steam apps, common, Left 4 Dead, Left 4 Dead. CFG. Um, I'm going to be putting the exact location of that just in case you couldn't follow that because it is a pain in the ass to get there for no freaking reason. Anyway, what you're going to do is, as you can see, I already have an auto exec file, but what to do to make it is you go to new, well, right click new text document and name that auto exec. And you just double click that to open it. And here you can write binds. Um, scripts if you'd like and this, what this will do is it just allow all your custom things to load once you start your game every time you start your game so if I want to be if you want to be annoying like I like to do just bind O vocalize player death or something I think that's what it is vocalize player death yes and that will every time you press O in that case is I'd scream like a little baby especially if you're Zoe it's really funny ha huh. um, another one I like to do is bind a key to quit the game. And what I usually do is right say I have to go shut the fuck up it's not a rage. And then you do semicolon disconnect. This will send in the server chat say I have to go shut the fuck up it's not a rage and then it will disconnect you from the server. Pretty cool. But yeah that's about it. Um, once you have your auto exec all set up of the way you want it, you're just gonna go auto exec and just put .cfg, and that's all you gotta do. Save as a .cfg. Click save. Um, it's gonna ask me if I wanna replace it. I won't ask you because since I already have one. But that's it. And then restart Steam if it's open, and then check your binds if they're working left or dead. If not, try it again. Watch the video again. Follow instructions more clearly. It's about all I can say. But uh, thanks for watching and subscribe for more. Yeah.